It's no secret Nebraska's offense has had trouble this year getting into a rhythm, and I thought what they did last week, the wrinkle under center in the I formation was a great example of adjustments they've made. I think we're going to see more of that here down the stretch as it was better suited for the offensive line. It allowed them to be aggressive, and it also allowed a guy like Diedrich Mills to get more comfortable, as I think that's a better fit for his running style. If you study Northwestern over the last three seasons, they're a very interesting team. Between 2016 and 2018, they were four and eight over the months of August and September. But then when the calendar turns to October and November, the Wildcats have been 21 and six. So they have been traditionally a slow starting team. They'll come into Memorial Stadium, obviously here in October. They played Wisconsin tough a week ago. So you know you're going to get their best shot. And this is a team that has traditionally been slow starting under Pat Fitzgerald. Looking at this matchup, one area I think Nebraska has to win, and I think they will win on Saturday, is their defensive line against Northwestern's offensive line. And Northwestern wants to run the football. They are not a good passing team right now. They're one of the worst passing offenses right now in all of college football. So it's imperative the front wins and forces guys like Hunter Johnson, Northwestern's quarterback, into some dangerous passing situations, as I think there are some big turnover opportunities here for Nebraska in this game. And finally, I thought offensive coordinator Troy Walter said it best on Wednesday. This is a get back game and a get back week for Nebraska after obviously a night to forget against Ohio State. And you look at this stretch of four games. There's four very winnable games, games that could kind of change the feel of this season. And it starts Saturday against the defending Big Ten West champions. Then you go on the road and you'll probably play an undefeated Minnesota team that plays Illinois on Saturday. So it's a tough stretch, but a very manageable stretch. And it's starts Saturday here against the Wildcats with the Huskers here in Lincoln. I'm Sean Callahan of HuskerOnline.com for KTV Newswatch 7 Sports. Thank you, Sean. Our coverage kicks off Saturday morning with Big Red Zone Game Day on KETV. Then join Sean and me at 1 for Facebook Live. Then it's Nebraska and Northwestern at 3. It's televised on Fox.